right now You said to yourself you'd be breaking every vow I can understand you're tired of this town And I'm not saying that we have to settle down now Just remember this We could have been stardust Same world but without us Something made us, made us find each other right there Made us realize we're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to do And I'll be out there looking for someone like you So I guess I should have known You said to yourself you wanna do this alone What if your dreams are making it hard to think straight If you still love me I can wait, I can wait And remember this We could have been stardust same world but without us Something made us, made us find each other out there Made us realize we're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to do And I'll be out there looking for someone like you So, in today's video, I wanted to film a home vlog because you guys love these videos and it honestly makes me so happy because I feel like this is what I'm most like, passionate about. Obviously, I love beauty, I love makeup and skincare and bits and bobs like that, but I feel like when it comes to like career-wise and I really think about what I love doing, it is taking you guys in my home, sharing like 
the insides and just my life um and yeah i really like that and it's so flattering that you guys also really like it as well so thank you so much just for your love and support as always because honestly it means the world to me and yeah i love you guys so much so i've got some parcels to open with you um very sort of like homely bits and bobs which i'm really excited about i know some of you are a bit like why do you always film unboxings and stuff like that it's so materialistic and the thing is like, i get where you are coming from but because this is my job and this is just what i like to do i like to buy things for my home make it look as nice as I can make it um, and just fit it into sort of like my style. I just love filming and including like unboxings in vlogs. But I completely appreciate that, you know, it's quite an odd time for everyone at the moment and I'm not saying you need to buy all of this stuff like in order for your home to be like homely because it's just a personal preference. It's what you like and I feel like it's also a really good sort of distraction in a sense from what's going on. Obviously I'm not blind to it loads of my family members have had covid and stuff like that and i know what's going on but i'm just talking about sort of my day-to-day -day life and what what can sort of like keep me sane in a sense <laughs> not go crazy because we're at home um but yeah i've got my iced coffee so i'm really happy um you would have just seen those pancakes i made honestly they were so nice but i literally had about three mouthfuls and then i was full why do i always do that i'm like oh my god i'll go over the top I bought like really cute flowers and stuff like that and then I literally had a couple of mouthfuls and I was full. <laughs> so, um, but I've kept it on the side so when Bradley comes home from work in a bit, he will eat them 100% so they haven't gone to waste. But how cute are the flowers? Um, yeah, I really like them. Just thought, you know what, why not? Why not make things spring even though the weather at the moment, like this is what I'm looking at. Can you see this weather? It's just a bit gloomy, it's a bit dull a bit rainy i'm just not a fan but yeah i've got some home packages to unbox with you a couple of house updates i want to share with you some like new interior bits and bobs that i'm really just obsessed with and yeah we can have a cozy day together so i'm really looking forward to it my hair's i don't know i'm just not feeling my hair at the moment i don't know what it is i feel like it's just a bit like flat i need to have like i need to get like a volume spray but i don't know Anyway, I'm faffing. Let's show you guys the unboxing. <laughs> okay, first of all, sorry if the lighting changes. It's just one of those gloomy days today. Um, yeah, not too sure what's going on. And my ring light is upstairs and I can't be bothered to go and get it. So, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, but I think it should be fine. So yeah, I thought I'd unbox what I got from the range because there's quite like nice home stuff in there at the moment. Not in there, I got it online. Um, I suppose it is open actually, so you could go. But yeah, I was just browsing and you know when you browse and you're just like, oh, that looks nice. And then everything is in your basket and you're like, oh my God, I need to buy it now. I was on there for quite a long time. Although I find the checkout or like looking in your basket at the range so annoying online because it's like, it's just got the loading sign does anyone else's phone have that problem please let me know in the comments because i don't know if it's my phone or it's just the website so yeah i've also got a really exciting delivery in here i'm just so excited to share it with you honestly it's going to be game changing but anyway i'll show you that after this i'll leave links to everything in the description box down below um so if you did want to pick oh god this is heavy if you need to pick anything up it will all be linked there and if you're none of the prices and stuff like that because I don't know them off by heart. Um, but yeah, the first thing I got was this. It's a marble chopping board. It is bloody heavy. Um, so you know it's like proper because it is so heavy. Um, it's really big. It's such a good value for money. I feel like it was around £20 from what I remember. I feel like anyway. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was really lovely. It's a really lovely thing to take like flat lays for my instagram on here so yeah i got it mainly for that <laughs> but i've also got one in the kitchen already and it just looks so nice it just changes the kitchen up a little bit so yeah but that one will go into my beauty room i feel like i'm developing a cold 
you know when you can like feel it in your like sinuses i'm like <laughs> it's not like i've been anywhere literally apart from tesco's <laughs> the next thing i got was a shoe rack i actually bought paint and i'm gonna paint it i feel like it's quite a nice activity getting stuff like paint and just having that extra me time and i feel like it's really good for your brain to like concentrate and stuff like that i'm reading loads of books at the moment and it's just really important to I can't, I don't know the technical terms, but just to keep your mind focused on something, especially with what's going on in the world at the moment, it's really good. So I got this and I'm gonna paint it. Although, funny story. So I bought paint, didn't look at the mill, and this is how small it is. <laughs> oh my God. Why did, I, honestly, why didn't I think to look? But do you know when you're on the website and it looked huge and obviously it's gonna look huge because it's up close i'm such an idiot when it came i actually i wasn't annoyed i was just like oh my god that's hilarious but to be honest with you i don't think i'll need more than this to paint this whole thing because i think it will just need one coat but if it does then i can just go into amazon or something and buy another one but i got this it's called a furniture paint in the shade hessian so yeah, I really, I want to see what that looks like. And then I also bought paint brushes um, just so I can paint it. And then it'll be a really nice sort of shoe rack we can have at the front door because we currently don't have one. And I feel like we just need one. It's just got to that point, it's just annoying. So yeah, I feel like that'll be just a fun activity just to paint with my small little paint. I kind of want to see the color of this. Oh my God, I love this color. How lovely is that? Oh my god, I love, absolutely love. Well, that's gonna look really lovely. So I put the lid back on like that. I'm not sure if I'll paint that in this video or I might do, I'm kind of just, I'm not sure. I'll see how I feel. Bradley is so gonna kill me, <laughs> but I got another throw. <laughs> do you know what my thinking is, right? We spend so much time on the sofa. I haven't got a throw that's really long, although I don't know if this is, Oh, this might not be as big as I thought, but it's a rabbit faux fur throw. It's so soft, lovely and grey. Other throws that we've got already, the dogs love them. Um, so I kind of just wanted to get a nice new one. You know, like a fresh throw. I feel like there's nothing better than a fresh throw, fresh throw. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to snuggle up with this later with a cup of tea and all cozy. I'm really tired today, I don't know why. Maybe I'm having a nap. I always say that, I'm always like, oh, I'll have a nap today and I never take naps, never. I bought a marble peeler. Um, there wasn't a picture of this on the website. It just said Marlo, Marlo? Marble peeler, what is Marlo? So I risked it and luckily it's really nice. So I'm really happy with that. More so for Bradley because he does most of the cooking, believe it or not. I used to. And then we got Gusto. Is it Gusto or Gusto? I think it's Gusto. We've had that for months now. Um, HelloFresh and Gusto are like my favourites. But anyway, we have that and a lot of them you need to like peel potatoes. And we have like a rubbish peeler. But like a painfully bad one to the point where sometimes he doesn't even use it. So I bought him it, um, so I know he's gonna be so happy with that. And then I also bought these. These are to go in my lanterns, which I'm going to show you now. On the floor here, at the moment, I'm gonna zoom in. Um, there are some white company ones in there. The seashell ones, which smell really lovely, but I don't know, I just feel like these will look really lovely in it. And then I can start burning those. <laughs> because the seashells scent, from the white company is so nice. And then sometimes I'm like, oh my God, I don't wanna burn it. Um, but I feel like knowing that I have these now, I'll be happy to burn them. These were so cheap. So this one was $1.99 and then the big one was $2.59. How good is that? And they look really nice. So I'm happy with those. Happy with those purchases. So that was everything I got from the range. And they sent it in this gigantic box. <laughs> Not too sure why, to be honest with you. Have I got anything else in here? Oh my god, imagine if I didn't look. Oh, I have a leak-proof water bottle. I got this for like coffees and stuff like that for when we go out. I feel like with the range, if you like something, get it quick because it's the sort of shop that like sells out with stuff really quickly. Um, so yeah, I bought that just for like, I don't know, I feel like it's good to have a flask, you know? Oh, it can keep things hot for eight hours and keep things cold for 24 hours. 
Why have I not had one of these before? I was clearly on a, like a marble thing last time. You don't understand how excited I am for this. I saw this advertised on Instagram a while ago. And you know when you see something, you're like, oh my God, that looks so good. I was really intrigued by it. And then weirdly, they messaged me and was like, we'd love to send you one. And I was like, oh my God. So it's from a brand called Beauty Effect. Looks like this. This is their cute little logo. Um, this isn't sponsored. But I thought I'd share it with you because when I saw it, I was thinking, Everyone needs to know about this. Oh my God, I'm literally so excited. Bradley's gonna kill me with the amount of recycling I've got. Um, oh my God, even the box that it comes in is absolutely stunning. So, ah, I'm literally so excited. Wow. The quality is unbelievable. So, this is what they have sent me. It is, this is just the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. This is a beauty, it's like a beauty travel sort of case. Um, and you open it up. Oh my God. And this is what it looks like. So this is actually like, it's like a travel makeup case, but you can actually take it anywhere with you. Um, I'm gonna put my everyday makeup in here. And you know, sometimes you wanna get ready in your bedroom or like, you just wanna, you know, just have it all in one place. It's really easy and convenient. So you open it up. Wow, the leather on this is beautiful. You open it up, it's got step-by-step -step sort of instructions and what it is and all that kind of stuff. It's a really good like storage for your makeup. You can put your brushes and stuff like that in here and this side. And then the best part, there is a mirror, but it's got an incredible light. Oh my God, look, I don't even need a ring light. I can just use this. It's got an amazing light. You can sort of dim the light. You can change the color. So you've got a warmer tone. You've got like a medium tone and then you've got the more white tone and then you can like dim the light. I like it on the brightest, but it honestly, is just amazing i saw this and i was like wow so it's just a perfect place to put your everyday makeup you can just sort of fold it like that fold this like that how cute and you've always got good lighting wherever you go whether you're doing your instagram stories or getting ready for the day or filming for youtube or you know doing anything even if you're not a youtuber or anything like that it's just so good to have i feel like lighting like this when you go from it to not having it you notice such a big difference honestly it's amazing i do need to charge it though um just so it's got its full power but i'm so happy look can you see yourself hi <laughs> so they actually sent me the beauty effect trio exclusive in the shade white they've also got the pinky sort of nude so there's, th there's two other stuff that come with it. This is honestly the most perfect gift to get anyone or yourself, like you need this. It also comes with this little bag. So you can put your, whatever you want in it, your hair stuff, your beauty stuff, um, or you can put this in here. Oh my God, this is so cute. And you've got like a proper bag for it. Um, and it just looks so lovely. It's got really lovely sort of Safiano leather. I know about Safiano. When I used to work in Kurt Geiger, like before YouTube, it was the most popular leather that they used and it was the best quality. So I love how they've got that and it just feels amazing. So yeah, this is what that looks like. And then there's also a smaller bag as well. Oh my God, this is just so lovely. Looks like this, but I would put my skincare in here. So I would have like my makeup and my hair bits and bobs like that in the other. Wow, this is amazing. And then you put your skincare in here, toothbrushes and stuff like that in here. This is brilliant. I know obviously we're in lockdown at the moment, but it's not gonna last forever. So I'm so happy that I've got this. So when we do finally go somewhere, I literally can just pick things up and go. I'm actually gonna put my everyday makeup into here just so I've always got it and it's just easy. And then when you do go away, you're not scared if you've forgotten anything because you use it every day. And the mirror is brilliant. Um, so yeah, I'm so happy with this. It just looks so beautiful. The color is amazing and you can sort of pop this like this as well. How cute, Oh! So thank you so much to Beauty Effect. Um, I just wanted to mention it because I saw them on Instagram 
and was like oh my god I need this and I feel like everyone needs it as well so I'll pop a link to them in the description box down below in case you guys wanted to pick it up for yourself or for a gift so yeah oh my god I'm literally obsessed I can't wait I'm gonna put all my bits and bobs like that in there now oh my god and there's even like a little pocket here do you know when things are really like thought through I'm so impressed I'm so happy ah look at this so cute. Anyway, I'm gonna clean up this mess and then I want to do my nails and then we can do some house updates because there's some bits and bobs around the house that I wanna share with you, like some new pampas grass, um, some new decor and I'm gonna show you in my wardrobe room. <laughs> I know you guys are going to be so happy about that. It's been like a long time coming. I don't think I've ever shown you in there before because it's been a mess. But I cleaned it over the weekend so it's finally tidy-ish. It's not finished at all but I'll show you guys in there because I know you want to see. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to pack this away. We can do our nails because look at them. And then I'll give you guys a little house update. Yeah, oh my god, look at the puppies. They're so cute. Anyway, rambling on as per. <laughs> so I just realised... It's gonna get dark, so I may as well show you guys um, the house updates now before the sun goes down. I don't know what this is on my face, so just I'm gonna turn the camera around now. I have got friends on, um, but this is one of the new things in the front room. This is my beautiful new pampas grass from Tony Dunn Flowers. That's where I get all my pampas grass from. It is just absolutely stunning. I think I want to get a new vase because I don't like how you can see like this pampas here do you know what i mean i mean i could pull it up but i feel like i need a vase that goes out at the top i love it i feel like it's so much nicer than the flowers that were there before i feel like it just ties in really nicely um and yeah i'm obsessed with it the next thing the garden's a mess um but we got a new little hanging basket it's actually fake flowers because <laughs> can you see here I'm going to zoom. This is the old one, which is just twigs now. It's absolutely dead. So we thought we'd get this one because that way it's not going to die. And it's just reliable, you know? It's like the ones here, they're all good. So far, I need to make it all cosy soon. It looks worse than it is, but I promise you it isn't. Um, the doggies are just having a little nap here. Recycling. I mean, this is just a daily thing now in our house. So you guys have seen, if you watched my previous video, I think I'm going to have to pop some lights on. Apart from the hoover, this is the sort of new vibe in the hallway. So we've got beautiful Desenio print and then a mirror here. Um, what day is this going live? Oh my god, this is actually going live the day that the discount ends for Desenio. So you have until midnight tonight to use my code AMYROSE30 to get 30% off Desenio. This isn't part of our paid collaboration, but I know I'm going to get questions on my new prints. Use my code tonight, otherwise it will end. Over here, we've got three more Desenio prints. I feel like I sound like a broken record from my last video, but if you haven't watched it, I did want to show you guys anyway. Um, I'm just obsessed with these. I literally love them so much. I can't wait to take mirror pictures in here and like them being in the background. So cute. My desk, um, it needs a little bit of a tidy. This is another beautiful bouquet um, and like display of dried flowers from Tony Donna Flowers. If you're local to the Brighton area, please message him because they're amazing. He also informed me that really soon he's gonna be opening a website where he'll be able to send um, like the ring flowers, like the dried like wreath sort of flowers really soon. So um, I'll let you guys know when that'll be on my Instagram page. But he told me the other day and I was like, oh my God, this is so exciting. But yeah, I literally love this. I do need to like give my desk a little bit of a tidy, hide the wires and like, bits and bobs like that but I love them and then this is our hallway so you guys know this is the bathroom Bradley put that door on upside down so the magnet doesn't work <laughs> so tonight he's going to be putting um, that door on the right way so it actually shuts because honestly I shut it and it just opens up again so please excuse that so in here is my wardrobe room um if I'm honest like the wardrobe here Oh, it was such a nightmare. If you followed my moving in stories, you would know about it. Um, basically, it's the owners who owns this house 
and he didn't want us to get rid of it so we've had to make do and the doors like didn't fit and it was just oh such a nightmare but anyway yeah, this is what it looks like in here stain on the rug so i need to get a new rug um and it's really yellowy the rug and i don't really like it so yeah i'm gonna change this really soon the grey ottoman that's in my beauty room, like the buttoned one, is going to come here in the middle and I feel like that will look really lovely. Um, up here, to be honest, it's not done at all. Like there's literally so much that needs to be done. Um, and then here is my wardrobe. It looks a mess, but it's actually organised mess. Um, my shoes are right at the bottom and then my like boots and trainers and stuff are here. All my clothes are hung up and then my bags are on there, which to be honest with you could be a bit neater, but it's just one of those things, isn't it? That, I don't know, I feel like it just always gets messy. Um, but yeah, that's what it looks like. So I just hide it with a curtain. But yeah, this is the room that you guys ask about all the time. So I thought I would show you in here. Yeah, it's not the neatest of rooms and it needs a lot doing to it. I wanna get a new rug, I wanna like, change everything put the mirror up on the wall um and stuff like that but it's just one of those things that it's just not like a necessity um however bradley is picking up my hair um the drill tonight so he can finally fix that and also i forgot to show i think i mentioned this in my last video but he's putting these handles up finally um so that's going to go here and it's just going to add a little bit of like something to the wardrobes because if you look before and then after it's going to make such a difference um so yeah he's going to put these up and i'm so excited about it and then obviously the bedroom is upstairs but not much has changed in there so i don't need to show you guys that oh my god look how dark it is and it's like half two now how crazy i think it's time to do my nails i feel like i'm always doing my nails when i pick one nail I have to pick all of them. Such a nightmare, but this is just hideous, so I need to pick up. Hello, Ramona. I can't shake the simplest feeling beyond the we stand on the opposite shore Hello, Ramona I reach through mysterious ceilings My only hope I look for the things I don't know Show me where the ending goes Honest, honestly don't I should be the last to know We're all in this, I stand alone Show me where the ending goes Honest, honestly don't I should be the last to know Honestly don't 
I should be the last to know We're all in this I stand alone Show me where the ending goes Honest, honestly don't I should be the last to know Okay, so as you would have just seen, I made sausage and mash for dinner. The one from Gusto is just the nicest thing ever. It's like sausage and mash times amazingness. <laughs> it's so good. Um, but Bradley has just done a really lovely thing and put the handles um, on the door, so I wanted to show you that. I've also, I'm like blinded by the lights. When all the lights are on in here, it's just, look, it's so bright all the time. Anyway, he's put them on. I'm literally so obsessed. Right, I need your opinion, please. Do, basically, we were one handle short, so we weren't sure whether to just leave these two um, or just keep them on their own because they're quite small and with the handle, it made it look a bit small. Or does it look weird? Do you reckon we should add them onto there? I don't know, I might order some and then see because they were honestly such cheap handles. I bought them on Amazon, um, I'll pop a link to them down below. This is them up close, just really simple. But yeah, what do you guys think? Do you reckon I should add two more or just leave them because they're smaller? But yeah, I need to tidy up all of this. Like, oh my God, you guys, look in here. There's just equipment, there's like, it's basically just bits and bobs. Um, and it just needs organising, it's stuff I've been sent, and just, yeah, bits and bobs like that, that just needs organising. It's so nice having an actual handle, um, so I can't wait for that to actually shut. I'm really happy that I can't wait just to redress all of this and make it all pretty, but I don't want to do it all at once. I kind of want to do bit by bit, so like, we've changed up here, which I love. Um, so now it's moving on to this part um, and yeah, I need to organise everything in here, in these drawers and in here as well and all of this. Um, but I reckon that'll come in the next few vlogs, I think. Slowly but surely getting there. This is what the marble chopping board from the range looks like. I'm obsessed um, and this little vase, I got it from ASOS, I think it was £10. It is so cute and I'm not sure what I'm going to put in here but it's got the most annoying label ever. I need to like soak this in some warm water um, to get that off because I would prefer this side but yeah the stickers are not doing it justice so I'm keeping it like that and I think I might put like a couple of pampas stems in it or something like that um, but yeah oh really cute I'm literally so happy with everything at the moment so I've now got in my cozy pajamas I'm gonna go downstairs finish watching our film what's it called it's called to all the boys I loved or something like that we're on the third um, film I can't remember which one it is but it's actually a really good film I like all of them so we're gonna finish that downstairs probably get some sweet and salty popcorn because we are obsessed um, and then yeah chill out but obviously you guys are coming along and I need to do my skincare with you guys as well full stop can't believe I live in your thoughts about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful delight. Okay, so we just finished watching the film. It's so cute. I really like those films. Um, I'm now going to take my makeup off. I'm honestly, I'm not feeling 100%. It's not COVID or anything like that <laughs> before anyone asks. It's more like fluey and just a bit run down. So I'm just feeling a bit like, oh, like really exhausted. I thought I'd take my makeup off with you. Um, I bought some more of these. These are like the pads um, from Amazon. They're a dupe for the face halo ones. They're just so much more cheaper and they're literally exactly the same. So all I do is literally wet it and then I get some micellar water. My favourite one is this from Garnier. It's like a rose one. 
and then I just sort of massage it in and then like can you see that it just literally your makeup will just sort of crumble off it's amazing and you don't have to worry about it going everywhere oh my god I so need to fake that <laughs> look at the difference oh dear. storm of lightning strike as we hold each other tight you're the rose in a garden I'm now going to use my Elemis Pro Collagen Rose Cleansing Balm. You guys know I literally love this so much. I don't apply like loads. I sort of spread a little bit around my face just because I realise you don't need like too much of this. And then I'm just going to grab my skincare device. I love the Lumi Spa so much. Nothing compares to it. I bought this on Amazon. It's a lot cheaper but just doesn't compare but my lumi spa broke like the charger snapped and then the head like was coming loose so i ordered a new charger and then a new head so fingers crossed they both work and then i'll let you guys know if it is all good but i just got this one from amazon and it just like pulsates but it's really good just to deep cut it and just skim you're the rose in a garden and it shows if i'm on it So red oh my god I'm so pale oh my god I forgot to show you my nails I'll do that in a second um, I'm now just gonna brush my teeth I've still been loving the spotlight oral care toothbrush and toothpaste this isn't part of our paid collab but I love it and Bradley loves it too he's like doing the whole treatment himself which is good so yeah love that give up everything that I own on my bedside table I have my five minute journal which I need to fill in for the evening one now um, I've always got water always literally no matter what I'll have water um, my Elemis Pro Collagen Overnight Matrix which I need to apply now um, and then I've got some books here which I like to read sometimes if I want that extra motivation and stuff like that Sorry, that was my phone. <laughs> my face looks so red and I don't know why. Like maybe it's because I'm so tired. Um, I forgot to show you guys my nails. I painted them, they took me hours, but they're finally done. I just went for simple nude square um, and I love them. I'm back, I'm back. So I'm gonna pop on my Elemis Overnight Matrix. I need to get a new one. I use it every single night and I have done for so long and it just works an absolute treat. I just sort of rub it in. It feels amazing and it really helps just to firm my skin and like when I stop using it I just notice such a huge difference in my skin and it's just made my skin feel amazing but using this in conjunction with my Lumi Spa was like the dream. But I really like to push it into my skin. And then any leftover, I'll just pop on my hand. I'm then also gonna pop on my Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream. I use this every single night, but Luna attacked it the other day. Can you see? Can you see all the bite marks? <laughs> Luna attacked it. I was so upset. I was like, no. So like, sometimes if I squeeze it too much, it comes out of this, like at the top. It's so annoying. But if you suffer with like dry lips, really dry skin, it's it's literally amazing for anything, like any cuts, um, any burns, anything you can think of, it will help. And like sometimes, you know when it's really like cold outside and you get dry knuckles, you put it on here and it just heals it. It's like magic. <laughs> it's like the magic AR cream, it's so good. Um, so I pop it on every night before I go to bed. Also, if I've got like a sore red red rose, red nose, which is me now, I'll just pop it on and then it just really helps it. So yeah, if you haven't tried that, I really recommend it. Um, I'm just going to finish my five minute journal for the day. It's literally a short and sweet book that I have been loving a lot more than I thought 
I would. It's such a lovely journal. Not only does it look amazing, it makes you feel really lovely because you don't have to spend so long writing like positive things or anything like that. It's literally five minutes, not even. And I love that. And it's just really nice to have on your bedside table as well. So I'll leave a link to this in the description box if you're interested. I literally picked it up from Amazon and I love it. Give up everything that I own. Give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found You're the road